Hey guys, I'm Sarah. So last week on Sunday, we wrapped up our six week series called She Speaks and uh, I talked about Leah and I chose Leah um, to talk about because I find myself in a lot of her story and I'm sure that a lot of you do as well. Uh, Leah is someone whose story is um, just riddled with pain and rejection and the feelings of the scripture says even hated and unloved. Um, and she wants nothing more than for her story to change, right? And that's where I find myself relating to her. I've had that, and you've probably felt that too. Um, she wants nothing more than her story to change. But then we see God come in and change her. Not her story, he changes her. And it's this really incredible scripture where we experience her setting aside the pain that she has really clung to and been defined by her whole life. She sets that aside and she offers God a sacrifice of praise. And it's this beautiful example of what that means to offer God a sacrifice of praise. And ultimately, God's going to use Leah's life, though it's full of pain and suffering, He's going to use her life to usher in the ultimate salvation of the world when she gives birth to Judah, who will um, carry on the line of Christ, which is just a really incredible story. Um, and so we learn in Leah's story that... It is God who's writing our story. It's not us, it's not our circumstances, but He alone. He's always redeeming. He's always working. Uh, and sometimes we struggle to trust Him with that, right? Um, sometimes we struggle to know and believe that He is good and that He loves us. But He has all asked us to um, set aside our pain and suffering and to offer Him a sacrifice of praise. And that can be really hard, but when we do, uh, he promises to move mountains in our life, and he does that every time. Uh, so with that, we're going to um, have some questions for discussion. So um, first question is, um, what did you take away from the sermon? What were you most challenged by or most encouraged by? Um, the second question is, through whose perspective do you normally read the story? Maybe Jacob, maybe Leah. Um, did you learn anything new in looking at Leah's perspective this past week? The third question um, is, what was God's response to Leah being hated? Scripture says she was hated. What was God's response to that? And why do you think that he responded this way? The next question is, how do you think God feels when you are struggling deeply? The next question, um, on Sunday I said, how we respond to the agony and chaos in our life will always reveal to us what we truly believe about God. Has any part of your story caused you to question or doubt something that you had believed about God before? And how did you handle that? Um, and also, how can we know the truth about who God is? And lastly, what do you think it means to offer God a sacrifice of praise? All right, guys, that's it. I really appreciate y'all discussing the sermon. Go easy on me, first timer. Um, I had a joy sharing the Word of God with you guys on Sunday. So, thanks.